Hello there, gentle viewers. You caught me catching up on an old favorite. Hello, gentle viewers, and welcome to another episode of Alistair Reviews It. Today, I am going to be doing my first book haul in a while. With all this social distancing and uh, quarantining, I've been using books to replace my social interactions and have such ordered a decent amount of them online. Uh, so I'm going to be going through these packages one at a time. So, some of them my husband already ripped open, so those might already be open, but um, I really didn't take any big look into them. And then some of them he actually ordered as well, so I might be surprised. Without further ado, let's go. Book. Discover books. I feel like this is Christmas. <laughs> what? I'm surprised even though I ordered it. It's, uh, I got, it's the Dragon Reborn, the sequel to The Great Hunt, the third book in the Wheel of Time series. This is The Great Hunt, the second book in the Wheel of Time series. And I thought this was this size. Now I have a book that is much bigger than all of my other books, and this is going to really bother me. What is this? I like how you're acting, Nate, like you don't know what any of these are. No, honestly, well, I, I don't remember. I do remember now. Peace and Turmoil by Elliot Brooks. This is a much bigger book than I thought it would be. How many pages is it? Damn. It goes into the 700s. Okay. You've never read a book past 100 pages that before. That's not true. That's not true. I usually have to read to them at night as a bedtime story. I wouldn't mind that. I gotta do like funny voices and stuff. Just to act them all out. Mm -hmm. I am Warbreaker! Okay, don't do that. That's just the next <laughs> This next one, Zachary already opened it, but it's an encyclopedia of women's wrestling. Yes, so by Latoya Ferguson, our, our acquaintance from the Slayer Fest live streams. Yes, she is a Buffy expert. And apparently a women's wrestling expert as well. Yes, and this will make a nice and colorful coffee table book. It will. <laughs> so many of these. You have a knife. What? You should, have, you should have had a knife. What? Brandon Sanderson's Arcanium Unbounded. I think this is the last thing I need to read from him in Cosmere. I've read The Emperor's Soul, the, the little uh, short story in it. I don't think I've read, I think this might be my last Cosmere book that I need to read. Yeah, I think it is. Last Cosmere book. It's a big one too. Move all the boxes. This one's big. This one is big. Oh. And I know, I think I know what this one is. Be very careful, please. I will, I will be very, very careful. not yours. They are ours, they are is that great? Yours. <laughs> they are ours. I'm lending them to you for your book haul. No, but I'm huh. doing it. <laughs> we, we got these together. No, you didn't. Yes, we did. No. All the Buffy stuff is legally mine. And no, it is not. It is. We're married. Half and half. Careful. Ooh. Tales of Slayers. Put it to these two. Buffy Season 8, Volume 2. And Buffy Season 8, Volume 1. This is one. Buffy Season 8, Volume 3. Oh no! I liked it until I saw that. 
Bucky Season 8, Volume 4. This one was already opened by Zachary. But it's Buffy Season 9, Volume 1. Oh gosh. And Buffy Season 11. That concludes my book haul. A lot of this is actually both mine and my husband's, so we're probably going to be doing a Buffy book hunt because it's been a pretty interesting time. Anyways, I will catch you guys less next time. Please like, what is it? Like, subscribe, and ding that bell. Yeah, like, subscribe, and ding that bell. So you popped on Twitter. Like, subscribe, ding that bell. Like, subscribe, like, surprise, with the Like, subscribe, with the Adios, gentle viewers.